If, if you like musicals and a bit of comedy, then it's good. Ryan, you like those things. Good morning, it's Danger Debs and a special guest. It's the one and only Poppy. I'm going to take him out for a walk soon. Oh, look. Look at that. I'm looking after him for the week. So right now I'm going to take him out for a walk. Then I'm going to head to town on my bike to go and see my world of work. My world of work. They're going to help me find a job in Glasgow. And then I'm going to go and see the new movie that everybody is so excited to see, Beauty and the Beast. And I thought since I've seen it, I'll wear something blue because she wears blue when we first see her in the movie. And I'll be at five o'clock. And then after that, I will be just back home here. <laughs> anyway, let's take this little guy out for a walk. Come on, Wolfie! Come on! Wolfie! Just taking Wolfie out. I don't have a dog. Do you have a dog? This is the third dog I've looked after my entire life. And they're all your criterias. Uh, Billy, Hercules, and Wolfie! I don't have a dog. I just babysit him sometimes. Don't die! Don't die! But he doesn't love me. He loves my mom much more. And she's had more dogs than me. When she was a kid, she had a lot of dogs. I never had a pet. I just babysit Wolfie. Or Billy. Or Hercules. And they're all Yorkshire Terriers. You're a Yorkshire Terrier, aren't you? Yes, you are. Okay. Don't, that, don't answer then. Oh, wait, you can't talk. Can you? No. Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna get my bike and cycle to town. I just remember something. Ages ago, I showed you my shed crashing down, and we got a new one. I never showed you the actual final piece of our new shed. This is it. It is very big. Like I don't have to duck my head at all. But I'm just gonna take my bike and my helmet only, and lock and just head off to town. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just taking a little break from doing one job application form. It's a long application form, but it's so worth it. Uh, but I'm just going to have a potato at Marks and Spencer's. I'm table number four. A little break. Now that looks good for 475. Potato with cheese. I go into Waterstones too much just look for new books and some ideas. And this is the book I'm reading right now. Um, Kiss Cam. It's really about a girl talking about her YouTube channel she does with the boys and their channel is called Vlog It and they started a new thing called Kiss Cam and two people in the book kiss a lot just to experience it they're not boyfriend and girlfriend but they just want the experience of kissing each other so a lot of kissing going on in the book this is, I get a lot of books in the teenage fiction area there's also the young adults fiction books I like horror songs Mother's Day is coming up. Sunday, Mother's Day in the UK. It's a nice sunny day and there's a lot of tourists in Inverness I say today because there's a lot of people taking photos on the Bruce Bridge behind me and it's basically because of this church. Why not? And taking photos of the castle that's behind me. And that castle is not actually a castle. It looks like a castle. But it's actually court. It's court. I'm telling you, I've not been there. I just know. It's a court. It's not a castle. It's not for the public. It's just for like, if you're in court, that's where you go. I'm telling you. Anyway, I'm just gonna head off to Eden Court, get my tickets for Beaten Beast, and then I'm gonna head back and do some more <sighs> applications for jobs. Yay! Fun times, fun times. But I must say, it's really nice and sunny today. It's really nice. Really nice. See? I told you there's a lot of tourists. 
there's a bus of tourists. I wonder where they're all from. Just got my cinema tickets for £7, which is really good, for a beaten beast, for one person, me. My family don't want to see it, but it's their loss. I want to see it, because it sounds good, but they don't want to see it, their fault, I'm seeing it. Have you ever seen a movie by yourself? This will be the first time I ever see anything by myself at the cinema. Or anything at Eaton Court. Huh. Seen the Pantomime family. Seen the Ice Skating Show one family. Yeah, this will be the first time I ever see alone at Eaton Court. Go figure. Hmm. Okay, this is new information to everybody in Inverness and anybody who's coming to see a show at Eaton Court or is coming to the Inverness Cancel Car Park. This car park. You have to pay if you want to park here from now on. This is new information. I mean, look. See? Paying display parking, 4 p.m. to 8 a.m., Monday to Friday, and all day Saturday and Sunday. About to up two pounds. That's gonna be annoying, especially for my dad. Because if we see shows at Eden Court, we usually park in here. And that's gonna be really annoying. Because I remember when it was free. I really do remember when it was free. And now it's not going to be parking here at all. Nope. Not going to be. That's very annoying. Wow, light goes on. Okay, I'm going to leave you for a moment because I'm just about to watch Beauty and the Beast. Just started. Trailers are on. I'm going to go watch Beauty and the Beast. 18 port. <laughs> My goodness, the movie was so good. Like, I was shaking, my fingers were numb, the vibration in the theater was so good. I just loved it. Being a Beast was so worth going to see. <laughs> there was fireworks at the end in my head. It was just that good. I would watch it again. I can't wait until it comes out on DVD. It was so good. I loved it. I just saw Beaten Beast, and this is Jack. Hi. He was supposed to see something that sold out. What were you going to see? Uh, Fast Lane by Jenna Watts. And that sold out? Yeah, she won a fringe first. It was in the chapel, so of course we uh, Chris couldn't get seats. It's a shame. But, you know, Ryan... Wait, Chris as in... Chris as in... Ryan right, NC? No. Different Chris? No. Different. Okay, then. So what are you going to do instead? Well, we don't know. You could see Beauty and the Beast, yeah. How was Beauty and the Beast? Tell us about it. It was really good, like... Oh my goodness. If you like musicals and a bit of comedy, then it's good. Ryan, you like those things. Musical? <laughs> yeah. It's really good. Well, what's the what's the blog thing? What's that all about? I vlog. I'm a vlogger. That's nice. Yeah. Like a... Like a I'm gonna, I'm gonna be very careful what I say now. <laughs> YouTuber. Yes. Put my lights on. I'm stable so people can see me. The front and the back. Nice. Cycling home now from Eden Court. Inverness at night. I know it's not the beast in Beauty and the Beast, but it's a Scotland beast. See, she's a Scottish cow with horns, just like the beast in the movie. Almost home, just pushing my bike up the hill. Almost home. Like the clock was saying, beating the beast. Turn back the clocks. Anyway, I'm home, safe and sound. My mum and dad did text me saying, do you want picking up deer? No, <laughs> I'm fine. I know I'm Vanessa. I've cycled in the dark before. Thanks anyway, but I'm fine. My lights work. And I had a helmet, so that's fine. <sighs> I feel safe at home. I'm safe now. I'm gonna ring Ryan now. See what's up. Yes, I would love my tea! Sorry! I wonder what I'm gonna have. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. Okay, I got some big news. You know YouTube? Well, you know. LGBT. Why are you telling me this? Yeah. I'm telling you this because 
YouTube have taken all them kind of videos off YouTube now. Well, that's good. That's good. Due to family watching yeah. YouTube stuff. Well, that's, that's a good move for YouTube. Yeah, kind of. But even if it's like a girl transforming herself into a guy just using makeup, mm -hmm. that can even be taken off. Well, even the music video Burning Lines has been taken off. That's good. Yeah, it's kind of good, I say. I'm just saying, because I'm just really talking about the news right now. Like, LGBT videos are not on YouTube anymore. Um, about the parking in Inverness. Um, a lot of my friends have got engaged. Just yesterday I heard one of my friends got engaged in Newcastle. So, well done to David Foden and Charlotte. Also, just looking on the news, someone also got engaged. And look what he did. The train station. He asked permission to get this on the board. He says, We met here on our first date exactly three years ago. Tonight I'm asking you to make these happy times go on forever and ever. Oh So well done to Craig and Liz Lizzie in Glasgow. Cause they got engaged. I'm too young to get engaged. <laughs> But that's a lot of news that's been happening this week. Even stuff with the Brexit. Anyway, before I keep on talking and rambling and bubbling and maybe almost tongue twisting my words, I'm going to head to bed because it's 10 o'clock. So thank you for watching this vlog. Hopefully it's not been boring. Please give it a thumbs up, comment below and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. This has been Danger Debs. The opposite of danger. Night night Wolfie. Night night. <laughs>